Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Mel7 Gaming. We're playing MechWarrior 5. This is Merc Tech, full game oh, uh, 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 mod. That's the word I'm trying to think of. Uh, by Maganforce GB. You can find it on nexusmods.com or on the Epic Store. So uh, I think, I know I had a plan for this one. I think we were going to run over. We were going to do a high value item, but I would really actually like to see um, our Lance of um, Hunchies go into, into combat. So We've got a raid contract here. We've got a raid and a, a war zone and a demolition here. I'm kind of thinking maybe we hop over here and we take a look at uh, at those and we will run with our full lance of hunchbacks that we built. We've got four hunchbacks, LRM, SRM, laser, and AC-20. Um, so we've kind of got everything set up for those. I think they'll be a lot of fun. They'll be a little bit under tonnage for the missions we're gonna be running here uh, in this system, but I think that'll be okay. Um, we'll find out. I mean, worst case scenario, I get my butt kicked, but that's that's not new at all. So it looks like the mission up top there that we're we're probably going to run on maybe tomorrow um, is the Cerebus Hounds, and that's going to get us five small lasers and three large lasers. Oh, sorry, tier three, um, one tier three large. Okay, eh, not huge, but you know, we'll we'll see about that. Um, so let's take a look at the contracts we have here. The Demolition War Zone appears to be slightly easier, so we'll go for it. Um, oh wow, we've got like no no negotiation points with the House Lao. They are actively hostile to us. Oh, anyway, that's fine, that's fine. We didn't expect much out of it. Um, we'll just kind of take one of everything and uh, we'll jump in and hopefully not take too much damage. Um, my Rifleman and Thunderbolt are still being repaired. We haven't been haven't been out of it long enough. Well, let's start with our LRM uh, hunch. Well, hold on, hold on. We were gonna make a change here. We were gonna take Horton out and we were gonna put Rich in. And now let's kind of see how I wanna do this. Um, I think I'm going to swap Kruger and Rich. So let's go ahead and put Kruger here. Let's put Rich back here. We're gonna give Rich the hunchy with the LRMs, which is the J, the J. All right, so he potentially can go up to six. He's slightly better now, but you know, that's okay. He's really good with kind of sitting still and tanking. Um, not as good about running around. Whereas Kruger um, is really good with lasers, with movement and with heat. So we're gonna go ahead and we are gonna give him, oh, I don't know, actually, I was gonna go with the lasers. His missiles are slightly better than Freeman's right now. Their lasers are pretty equal, seven versus eight. Um, they both have the same heat, although Freeman's maxed out with it, whereas Kruger could go a little bit higher. Um, let's go medium lasers back here. I think, uh, there we go. Um, yeah, I think that'll work. And then because he's got to get in a little bit closer, maybe that additional, uh, uh, tanking ability that he has, um, will come into play. You know, the SRMs are a little bit more of a close range. LRMs, he can be out about 400. He doesn't have to be in as close. And then I'll take the AC-20, because why not, right? So that is our Lance of Hunchbacks. And like I say, we're kind of, you know, one Hunch missiles, one Hunch lasers, two Hunch missiles, and one Hunch AC-20. So if the uh, opponents focus fire us, we could be out of guns really fast. All right, looks like we actually have game audio today, which is nice. That said, Farhad will never shut up about it if your mix return to the hangar looking like Swiss cheese. Good luck. All right. Be interesting if you would hire your own techs um, and maybe have some sort of skill based on, you know, armor repair, you know, weapon overcharging, that sort of stuff, right? Where you could get into that side a little bit. I mean, we're already managing pilots with stats. It'd be nice if we could also have techs with stats. I think that'd be pretty cool. Who knows, you know, we got the, the DLC coming up. I haven't heard anything even remotely along those lines, but, um, but I think it'd be pretty easy to implement. All right, we got 22 forces. We're gonna have to. Uh, are they after somebody already? They're kind of running around out there. Ah, oh, we do have bad guys out there. Um, let me get out of the building here. I'm 
stuck on him. We hit him twice with AC-20s. Three times. I'm not sure I got him that time, but he is almost dead. We'll go after the one I was shooting. Never mind. We'll go after... Never mind. <laughs> we do have a lot of firepower here. These are... These are some pretty serious little little mechs at the moment. There we go, right through the back. I'm going to hold on to some... Uh, how much ammo do I have left? 97. All right, we've got plenty. We did well. What do we got? Did they come down in the deal here? Looks like. All right, I'm going to sidestep this building here. And we'll come at him from here. Those guys are in there. Little commando action there. I thought I missed that one, but apparently not. That mech is about to pop. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to waste too many more ACs on him. Let's see, can we finish him with lasers? Ah, screw it. And then I hit, didn't hit where I wanted to. Oh, I thought for sure he was going right there. There we go. Uh, we are... Is that one done? Sounds like it. She said somebody was toast, so I'm assuming so. Have some more vehicles in there. Is that last tank gone? I don't think I want to take that at that shots while he's coming in. So let's. Uh, oh, what do we got over here? We have. I think that was a mistake. I don't think they're there. I think that was a, a glitch. All right, I'm going to spin back around now that we got guys in the building here with us. Okay, we've got an assassin and we've got a javelin. I hit him in the arm, darn it. Come on, buddy, give me the back again. Ah! Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to come right over here, and I'm going to shoot a building, and then I'll step on this guy. <laughs> Somebody else got him. Okay. Um, looks like the other guy's gone. So we've got the assassin in here. I don't think I'm getting the kills this time. Oh, they're coming down right on top of me, aren't they? Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's see if we can get that arm off. Not sure how that was a shot to the front, but... Man, this thing really can actually pump out the AC-20 rounds if you, you sit on the trigger there. Really, the, the, the missiles are the ones that are taking a long time to recharge. Or the lasers, excuse me. Big kill confirmed. Got him. All right. I mean, it should just be this dude running around from this group. 
Oh, that was a complete whiff. So was that. I just expect him to come over more. Oh, maybe not. Maybe that spider's still up and running. Not sure what they killed. This is the last guy back here. We've rolled through here pretty pretty well. Kruger's really the only one that's taken any damage. I've got 55. I don't have to be nearly as surgical with my C20s as I'm used to. Um, I think we're okay. Well, then again... No, we're going. We're going. Um, he's... That hunch is about ready to go. So we're going to say F3. Uh, F3. Let's get him out of there. Everybody else can go where they want, but we don't want to lose that hunch. We've got a lot of really expensive medium lasers in that thing. So, of course, he's hanging around and getting shot in it. Come on. Get us out of here. That thing has six, what, tier three, tier four uh, medium lasers? It's like, no, I'll sit and tank with it. All right, well, that was fun. Um... The cicada, for whatever reason, seems to be like one of the most expensive, but there's a javelin there. Uh, we'll go ahead and take that. I don't see anything here we can't live without. Um, we've got those ammos. I mean, it's a tier 3 AC5, but I think we've got enough AC5, so I think we just go for the money. We'll just sell that. All right, leveled up his uh, heat management, as he will with uh, eight medium lasers. Uh, Rich did well, leveled up. Well, didn't level up, but got XP in three different areas, which is nice. A little bit of damage, not too bad. Go ahead and repair everything up. Not really sure what that leaves us as far as mechs. We've got, what, six mechs left? Let's see if we can get into a mission with those six. We'll see what Disarm the Dissidents here will do for us. We'll take our three. We'll hit OK. Um, all right, we've got 230 tons that we could take there. Um, Archer, quick draw, quick draw. That's not really going to be enough. Um, Uh, where's that quick draw? So that leaves us 110 tons, so 50 and a 60. The 60 we've got, the 50 we do not. What if we go into it with just three mechs? What if we say... Um, what if we give Kruger a day off? Um, I take my... And he goes there, and we go in something like this. I think that'll be fine. That should be just fine. Destroying the Mark's industrial infrastructure will destabilize the opposition's grip on this region. Something our benefactors are willing to spend a great deal of sea bills to see done. Tactically, we're probably better off going to the left, coming up through the middle, and having that larger area to fight in rather than come through kind of the funnel, the choke point here. Um, so if I was in charge of this in real life, we'd probably come up, try to spread out, come in on the, the flanks of those two hills there. But you know what? This is Mech Warrior, and I'm just trying to uh, get some missions done. Um, and let's see, our Gauss is one. Destroyed. Target, okay. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. 
All right, spin back around. We're kind of behind everything here. All right, to the back there. All right. I think we just took off a shoulder. Was that was that gone before I shot him? Let him finish him. Wow, there's a lot of dudes out here. All right, I need to stop. My heat is, oh, it's just heat. Um, but, yep, there we go. <laughs> I was thinking it was gyro, but, because we were slowing down, but the heat does that too. Uh, and we haven't been destroying the base, which is a problem. Um, I better get in here and do some of that. And we'll just, uh, we'll get in here with the, uh, with the gauss as we destroy this place. All right, heat's down. Watch out, that mech is going critical. Really? Oh, wait, I'm gonna ignore him now. And we're going to start walking our way through here. It's not the world's greatest mech for this. Oh, we can just go through walls. Let's just knock out some walls. Uh, but we're doing okay as far as what damage we've taken. we take out all of this at once? Ah, the excitement of crashing down an alley in a battle mech. Are any of these kind of sort of injured? Let's take out that arm. Heat, arms gone. Tanks gone. Tanks gone, there we go. Can we walk through that? Yeah, we can. How about this one? Target health, we're not even to 50% yet. I really need to start crushing stuff. I just completely whipped on all that. There we go. What are we up to? 39. We seem to have destroyed most of the stuff. Although we got some stuff coming back in. He's still running around with his LRMs.
Can we walk through this? Yeah, there we go. 14%. This is about one of the tougher tougher uh, bases we've had to destroy in a while as far as kind of configuration and size. that out our heats up again we're just gonna kind of duck and weave here actually we're gonna jump just use our speed to get out of here it's the whole reason we got it there we go three max in three max out quick draw took a little bit of damage with rich that's fine and uh lucky destruction that I needed to pay more attention, as usual. I mean, that's usually the deal. I get so caught up in shooting the mechs, I don't go in for the destruction. We should build, like, a a destruction-specific mech. I mean, we have the Thunderbolt, you know, with the machine guns, but something like that, something, maybe something with just a couple machine guns somewhere on it with some speed that you can get in and just start blasting stuff and not really worry about the mech so much, um, just something that can... Uh, uh, just something that can destroy buildings quickly. So maybe like a large laser to give yourself a big sweep and some machine guns um, to kind of blow through stuff as well. That would work well. Um, I guess a couple of these tier two. I mean, I've got a few of them. There's no point in, you know, the tier one if we can get tier two. So everybody did well. Uh, we did lose an arm on the quick draw, which is what? Maybe a medium laser? I guess we shall find out in a second. Um, quick draw. Yeah, lost a, a tier one medium laser. Ah, that's fine. Um, I guess, actually. If Magnus, do I have another Magna kicking around? No, okay, well, we'll take that one out, and then... Oh, those are all Magnus, aren't they? Um, here, you know what? Just so everything matches up for firing patterns, we'll just go with the four Diplins. There we go. They're all tier one, so same tier as what he was running. Everything will match up. Um, Hunchback is... Not repaired? Did we forget to... Oh, because we've got... Oh, we did lose one of those. Well, that's annoying. All right, well, what else do we got? I think we have another one, right? Yeah. There we go. Start work. Um... Awesome. I think it's fine. We're just going to start coming in here because if there's one thing damaged, it won't show up on the... Re It'll let you do a repair all. Um, and then you'll get in there and you'll find out you're missing something. So, Hold on. Do we have any better PPCs? Oh, we have one tier two Lord's Light. Do we want to swap it out maybe for the arm one? I mean, we're more likely to lose the arm. But um, it's also the most useful one because we have the most options with aiming it. I think we'll do that. We'll go ahead and upgrade that. So that went from, um, we had a cruise, right? So we're doing two DPS with it to 2.15. Um, range is 483, range is 460. So we are getting a little bit more range with it too. So for picking off helicopters and stuff would be awesome. Um, and let's see what we did here. I don't think I took any significant damage. No, it's just armor and stuff. We'll go ahead and fire that there. And I think that's it for the episode, guys. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Uh, we saw Rich in, in action a couple times. He did okay. And um, we saw our hunchies. So that's it for now. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day. Cheers.